I can't imagine that I would have done anything else with my life. I, I can't think of another occupation. I can't think of another city. I can't think of another sport. The Buffalo Sabres and RJ were meant for each other. Coming to center, dumps it off the boards in the corner. Robert going after it. He scores! Robert! And the must win it again in overtime! In this town, the triumphant moments, the unforgettable excitement. Right on the credits, they score! Did it But did that really just happen? Ecstasy? It's all tied to what we heard. Hockey in Buffalo became art on a spoken canvas. Backhand in front! The Hatchik with a miraculous save on Quatch! Do you believe? Oh, brother, we are not worthy! He reaffirmed our faith and turned a simple rhyme into a christening. He's made going in on goal, he shoots, he throws! I'm identified by that one moment. The day I die, they're gonna play the Rick Jenneret's voice and call, and everybody will smile, and they'll toast Rick Jenneret because it's unbelievable. Buffalo wins it in overtime. There's no one else who could have told our story quite like you. There are two constants in the history of the Buffalo Sabres. The city of Buffalo and Rick Jenneret. I'm telling you, the man is brilliant. It's just there. It just comes out. And Albertson cuts in front, scores! Jason Bobbinbell, short-handed! Oh, now do you believe? Now do you believe? When I hear his call, I still get chills. These guys are good, scary good. He made the game so exciting on radio that when you actually saw it live, it wasn't as exciting as he made it. Clear right out in front, backhand by Hannon, he scores! Dave Hannon! Dave Hannon is mobbed by his teammates! Dave Hannon finally put away the backhand! And this series is going back to where Jimmy Hoffa is! Since 1971, Rick's unmistakable voice has served as the backdrop for the greatest moments in Buffalo Sabres history. Tonight, he gets his moment. We are all here because of this true, one-of-a-kind, Mr. Rick Jenneret. RJ is, to the truest sense of the word, one-of-a-kind. He is every bit, if not more, the Sabre of all time. You hear his voice and you automatically think Buffalo Sabres. He's the best there is. You never know what he's going to say or where it's going to come from. Hi everybody, this is Rick Jenneret. Hello everybody, this is Rudy Jenneret. Believe me kids, uh, the Easter Bunny does not look like this. <laughs> <laughs> but, but you do look sort of cute. I Thank must you admit. very much. He told me you're going out last. I said fine. I said okay RJ, go. Okay, I'm good. I was pretty cocky up till late. And then I heard the fans <laughs> uh, knock the snout out of me right back. I'm supposed to say something about Rick, but I think the crowd just said it all. Keep loving him.
Every fan, every player in the arena knows the moment isn't complete until they discover your call. Oh, You listen to his call, and the excitement's always there. Oh, Alexander McCulley, who says this guy is afraid to fly? He left the vapor trail. Spontaneous. It didn't look like it was memorized, rehearsed. Is looking for Emery. And over comes Peters to grab Emery. It's the passion, the spontaneity, the joy, the goosebumps, the humor, and the countless YouTube searches. There's the top 10 RJ calls, and I made it onto a couple of them. I remember sending it to all my friends. Friendship, your mentorship, and for making the plays that we made on the ice live forever through your one-of-a-kind calls. I speak for all Buffalo Sabres alumni when I say you deserve to be in the rafters as much as anyone who ever wore the uniform. You are the Buffalo Sabres. Rasmus Dahlin rips it in. Alec Tuck took that one home. I just wanted to get one goal when he was calling the game. It's something that's really special to me and something I'll never forget. But the shot's gone! James Thompson, his eyes lit up when it came to him, and he hammers it home on the power play. It's gone! Kyle Laposo just would not say no! That man is pumped! I find myself sitting in my basement playing hockey with my little guys and I'll be impersonating RJ. His calls are going to live on forever. Oh, my! You're going to want to look at that one again and again and again. Tim Connolly turned himself into a corkscrew. But really, it's the man. The beating heart of Sabres hockey. You know, that friendship you created and that uh, camaraderie, and, you know, working with him in a game, it's uh, it's like no other. And slides in over the line. And cookie shot. Oh! Are you ready, Legion of Doom? Here come the Buffalo Sabres. This is the only job I ever wanted. And this is the only place I ever wanted to be. Hello, Shuki Storm! Rick Martin! Hello, Robert! Hello, Tim Horton feeds Rick Martin. The minute that headset goes on, he's there. He sounds like he's 30 years old again. From my lips to your ears, thanks for listening. So how do I acknowledge the hundreds of thousands of people who have gone through the doors at the Odd and here at Key Bank Center? How do I acknowledge millions listening and watching over the last 51 years? I'll tell you how much I appreciate your beautiful noise. I have only three words, just three. I love you. See a thumbs up, the crowd's acknowledging him. What a great night for RJ. Ladies and gentlemen, Rick Jenner. They're gonna say he was probably the most exciting, you know, play-by-play -play guy that, you know, that we've ever heard. He is, in so many ways, this franchise. Your name will hang in the rafters. Top shelf, of course. He'll live forever because, you know, it'll be there.
but your voice will echo forever. Thanks for traveling around with me on this road for the last half century. It's been a hell of a ride.